and welcome back to another Shazza Casa video. Today I am going to be showing you um, our collection of the, um, the year two, like as I mentioned, uh, um, figures, sorry, Whew. and the things that I come with. So today we're going to be starting off with uh, Fantastic Beasts and this is Newt's Commander from Fantastic Beasts. Give him a twirl around. He's got his one there. His nice clothes. I like their clothes. And here's his base. It's blue and gold, and there's an S for Scamander there. I think that's for Scamander. So then, let's move on to what he comes with. He came with Niffler here. You probably all recognize him from the movie. Um, he, let's twirl him around. So the eyes there on the side. And he's sitting on a pile of gold. See? And then you probably can't see it on, cam on camera, but he has a pouch full of gold there. But it's kind of hard to see on camera, so... Yeah. Next, still in Fantastic Beasts, we're going to move on to Tina Goldstein. So we'll give her a twirl around, of course. That's what we do. She's got a wand there, and she's wearing her hat. And it's, it's a nice sculpt for the hat. I quite like it. And then we take her off. Oh, just, just don't mind her there. <laughs> she's passed out on the floor. And this is her base. I'm not completely sure what that symbol thingy in the jig means. It's dark grey and light grey. And then let's move on to what she came with. You probably all recognize this from the movie. It is Swooping Evil. Um, yeah. Put <laughs> a twirl around. There. And then, still in the wizarding world, but moving forward a few years, we have Harry Potter. Let's see, here he is. Um, turn him around. He's got his Gryffindor robes and a wand, of course. And he's got his glasses, and he does have a scar. You just can't see it very well there. His, his, his hair was covering it. There's a scar there. And then, we'll take this off. Just, just please don't mind them when they fall over. It's... By the way, if you hear weird noises in the background, that's my cat, Grey. And um, this is the the base. It's gold and kind of a reddish color. It has the lightning bolt, sc bolt scar on it, and is the Gryffindor logo thing. I think it's a logo. I'm not completely sure. Crest. Crest, that sounds right. Doesn't it sound right? I think it sounds right. So, here it... Oh, wait. He comes with the Mr. Weasley's flying enchanted car. I'm going to skip this. You probably all recognize this from the second book or movie, whichever you like best. It's blue. So, the um, white roof. So then, let's move on to the next one. Still in the wizarding world. Don't worry, we're not going into anything else. The last wizard. Voldemort! <laughs> sorry. sorry. So this is Voldemort. He's bald, of course. <laughs> this is his cape or robes. I'm not sure what it is. He's got his wand. He's all in black. So then, you take this off. Here's his base. It's got a serpent on it. Looks awesome. And he comes with the Hogwarts Express. Not so evil, of course. And um, it's just a nice red train. Oh, that was my cat. Sorry. Sorry. Um, then, next, out of the wizarding world, we have... Finn, the human from Adventure Time. <coughs> so, twirl him around. He's got a sword, backpack, helmet, hat, thingy magic on his head. I've honestly no idea what that is for. 
no idea. Um, this is his base. It's a, a grass with a sword in it, and there's a snail up there. And there's other th random things on this. So then, we'll move on to... He came in... Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> he came in level pack. So, he came with two things. He came with... Um... He came with... No, it wasn't Bemo. Sorry. Sorry. It was the Ancient War Elephant. Here it is. And then... Take it off. He also came with... The Jake car. There. Twirl it around. Jake as a car. And coming up is Jake himself. Not car form, just normal Jake. He's a small figure. He's holding a torch. And this is his base. I have no idea what that is. I don't watch Adventure Time. So, yeah. And then he came with. Nah, here's Bemo. He came with Bemo. It wasn't Ben. It was Jake. Jake came with Bemo. So here he is. He's kind of like a robotic computery thing. I don't know what he is. Let's see. Uh, as I said before, I don't watch Adventure Time, so you guys have to tell me all about this. And here is the Lumpy Space Princess. Um. Yeah. So, yeah, you know, she twirl her around, so there's the back. She's holding her phone. Take her off. Just a second. Sorry. She came with this. Just a second. She came with this, um, block thing. This invisible, non-invisible, see-clear thing. There, and this stuck to the, the stand. Sorry. The base. Getting everything mixed up. So it's purple, and there's one little... A uh, yellow star there. So I'm just saying, is she screaming? Why is her face like that? I have to fix her phone. It just fell off out of her hand. She's giving me so much trouble. So she came with the lumpy space car. It's designed like her, except pink, not purple. She was purple, kind of purple. Do you think she was purple or pink? I have no idea. So turn around, she's got a star on the front. Nice seating area there. Okay, and now, out of adventure time, into the world of superheroes and Lego, we have Excalibur Batman from the Lego Batman movie. His cape is cloth, not the other material that other people use. He's got his metallic kind of bat suit with his big gigantic sword. His belt and take him off there. Just leaning him up against that because everybody else just fell. So here, it's kind of like it's got blue and yellow there, and it's kind of metallic, and it's it's got the logo there. So then take this, put this back on, and he came with the. Just a second. Sorry, I remember it now. The Bionic Steed. I had to write some of these names down. I forgot about them. <sighs> so, turn them around. It's just like a metallic... Oh, I almost fell over. Metallic horse there. It's really cool. And then, still in Lego Batman, we have... Um, Batgirl. So she's the purple Batgirl, purple and yellow Batgirl. She has a ponytail there, and she's ho she's holding a batarang. Take her off, lean her against this because otherwise she'd fall over. She almost did. And here is her base. It's purple and yellow, and it's got the bat signal on it. So she came in a level pack with Robin, and. They came in one vehicle, so just showing Robin first and then the vehicle. Okay? Here's Robin. He's got his um, red and green outfit, his yellow cape. He looks awesome. His little green pants. 
so funny. And his glasses, his green glasses. I think that's a night vision. I'm not completely sure. There, his, this is his stand. It has the ore on it, and it's green and red. His colours. And then him and that girl, they came with the bat wing. Yes. So it's really, really cool. It's like a big plane thingy. <laughs> and it's like thrusters there on the back. That's tires, wheels. I don't know. It's like guns there on the side. Really awesome. I think that's the cock cockpit, that yellow thing. And then, moving on from Lego Batman, we have Sonic the Hedgehog. Really fast guy. <laughs> that's all. I, that's honestly all I know about him. <laughs> he's fast. He collects rings. He has a music in a game. That's all I know, honestly. I've never ever played um, Sonic the Hedgehog. I think it's a game, right? It is a game, right? I'm pretty sure it's a game. This is his base. It's got a checkered pattern. It says Sonic and has his head on it, his face. And then, and we get him up. We put him back, and he comes with the Sonic Speeder. It's a nice blue car here. It's quite pretty. He comes in a level pack. And then, he also comes with the tornado, this red and yellow plane. Now I'm pretty sure this is a plane. And the thing doesn't spin around. Well, you could if you made it hard I don't know. So, moving on from Sonic, we have Mission Impossible. Da, 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 da. No, that's not the music. I don't know the music. I forget it. <laughs> Ethan Hunt has. Look close in his face, he's got the microphone thingy-majig. I can't, I'm calling everything a thing, thingy-majig. He's holding binoculars, so if we take him off, and him against this, otherwise he'd fall. You look at his stand, it's all black with yellow, uh, not yellow, why am I saying yellow? Red lines, and it says MI, for Mission Impossible, of course. So we take him off, he comes with the... IMF sports car, sorry, I'm put down. Um, it's, it's white and black. I've only seen one of these Mission Impossible movies. It is awesome. Seriously, check them out. They are so cool. And then, it also comes with the IMF Scrambler. It's kind of a motorbike thing. And it's got the lights there. Yeah, it's really cool. I don't know where this is, in which movie it is or something. Oh, I can't even talk right. And then, sadly, um, I think this is the last one. Yeah, this is the last one. It is E.T., the extraterrestrial. It's got a cool head. I like that head. It's really cool. And it's got a flower and a flower pot. And then... This is his base. I think it might have been on his base backwards. Oopsies. It's kind of dark and it's blue. No, wait, it wasn't on his base backwards. Oopsies again. Where was it? I'm confused. Well, it's got the the guys cycling. I've never seen this movie. movie. Sounds really cool. People cycling on a flying bicycle. in the um, Casting a shadow over the moon. It's really cool. I really want to see that movie. <laughs> And he also comes with E.T. Phone Home. I have no idea what that means. I think it's like... I have no idea what happens in the movie. But don't spoil it for me. I'm probably going to watch it. So then, t turn it around. It's got a wire. This wire here. And the phone. And the phone thingy. <laughs> phone thingy. I am so weird. Sorry. Well, anyway, sadly, that is... The last of them. So, thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like down below and leave a comment in the comment box. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye.